Hello everybody, this is Alexandre from Angel Carter Mency and this is your weekly Le Normand video. So hope that you'd had a wonderful week and a great start for spring. Okay, this is the season that I really en enjoy. Uh, here in the Southern Hemisphere, actually spring is like during the month of November where you are in winter, we are in spring. And here we are still in summer, it's really hot, it's really windy. And uh, this is the time of the year where really we think about, you know, like we do a little review on what has been going on during all winter and what things fresh we're going to bring on the table for this new spring. And uh, for me, lately it had been, you know, very much uh, a lot of work, readings and teachings and with my clients here in Reunion and also with my book and deck, which are going to be uh, available soon. Uh, the date it comes out is on the 28th of April, a month now. And we are looking forward to that, seeing everyone having their decks and working with it and reading the book, The Art of Lenormand Reading, which is my take on the Lenormand Oracle. My take on it is traditional okay I respect traditional a lot I you know respect the uh, the method of reading the Lenormand which is the near and far method which is you know the nearest a card is to the querent or the significator the more it has an impact on the person's life and the less you know the far it is from the querent and the less uh, impact it has on the current. And I also en en emphasize upon the reading in pairs, okay, reading the cards two by two because Le Normand is all about association and combination of cards. You really need to get that for you to be able to read the Le Normand. And my book really takes you from, you know, a beginner to the level of reading fluently the Grand Tableau. And if you are a seasoned reader, it will you know, give you some ideas on how card can be read, perspective on astrology. I've put things on, uh, you know, on health, on being in a relationship for those who are not in a relationship. Talk a lot about, you know, focus card, master card, all these, you know, beautiful things and all packed in this beautiful 200 pages of wisdom. Okay, I really encourage you to get your own copy and to dive into it, and I make Le Normand really accessible to all, okay? And uh, also, you have been asking about, you know, me teaching, why I'm not doing any tu tutorials on uh, YouTube. So the thing is, I was very busy on doing the French videos, okay, I really wanted to, you know, give them time to assimilate and see my method of reading. And I believe that during the month of uh, when it will be summer for you guys, I will be doing more tutorials, you know, on how to read the Grand Tableau, on how to read, you know, the advanced level of Le Normand, okay? So for our weekly reading, I have my cards just there next to me and we are going to play with it and see what is the general theme of this week, okay? Let's pull, you know, three cards that will tell us the story of the week, okay? And let's take one card, a second one, and a third one. They just want to pop out of the deck. Okay, oh good. Okay, good, good, good. So, the three cards that came uh, for us today is the garden, the man, and the key. Okay, so it's a very important wing for us. When things, you know, end with the key, the key is all that is important, things that are handy, things that you know elements that really help us to succeed in 
any ventures, endeavors, any project that we have, okay? Starting with our focus card, we have the man. Everything will be focused upon you and the ability that you have to deal with things, okay? Uh, and when the man appears, like in a small reading like that, it's also telling you that you have the power. Being in the focus card position tells you that everything is, you know, upon you you have the capacity you have the talents you have everything uh, if you hear the wind or the birds out there know that it's a very windy day and perhaps through the windows there will be some kind of you know a wind and birds uh, singing and tweeting around okay like that so it's bringing you know, life to my reading i really love that so yes we were talking about you as the focus card okay you have the talents and the ability to deal with things okay so maybe uh these few weeks ago or this this last season of winter you have been like negli neglecting yourself you have not taken enough time for yourself you had not focus all your attention on moi on you okay and this is the time you know to really get your priorities really get your priorities really get what you need to do okay and garden garden is a card that tells you you know you're going to meet wonderful people make new friends you are going to be in good company and it's also the time to go out spring garden you know it's the theme so with the garden it's really telling you that now it's time to go out and if you like you know if you want to meet someone also as a soulmate relationship being at home will not help okay you need to go out and you need to have to party you need to uh, to be festive you know and be open open and receptive to the people that you might find out there okay the garden is a very beautiful note okay if you work in a corporation this is what I'm getting with my intuition. If you work in a, in a corporation, the garden is the best atmosphere that you can describe, okay? You have this atmosphere where everyone is relaxed, everyone enjoys what the, they do. They take the time to look at things and, you know, really time to relax also, okay? And it's also an invitation for you to be more of this, you know, free spirit, okay free spirit you know don't put yourself in a box don't go by the rules be like freestyle as well this week okay <coughs> sorry and then we move to the key that ends our reading and the key like i said you have all the solution all the opportunities that you need to be successful okay you have everything that you need to be successful so what we understand, let's do a little summary of this reading. This reading is all about you taking back your powers. It's about you being the master of your life. It's about you choosing what experience you want to, to have, what sort of people you want to be, and what sort of group you want to be part of. The cards with the garden and the key really tells you, you know, be with the winners, be with the people that inspire you, be with people that really give you this strength, this, you know, this power, okay, to do things and to make things happen. It's no more time to play the victim, dear. It's time to be the conqueror. It's time to be triumphant. And you have the power. So this was your reading for the week and uh, please add a comment below and thumbs up if you like this video and if you have any Whatever you want me to do, please put them down in the comment below and also don't forget to click upon the magic button to subscribe to the channel okay show me that you like my channel show me that you love my content and I will be glad to make more of this okay have a nice week guys and see you later